Yeah, thanks Jennifer. Good evening once again from Ormond. We're in southeast of the CBD uh, with a couple of kids and uh, well, it's all about discovery here and I have with me Phoebe and Juliet. Now, what are you doing there? Juliet? Oh, okay. And when you leave school, you'd like to? Be a vet. Be a vet. Okay, that was what I think you are going to say. Okay. And what about you, Phoebe? What are you doing over here? Amateur radio. Good morning, up out of bed. It's minus five degrees, like that. <laughs> and what are you going to do when you leave school? Be a weather, weather. I'll be a weather woman. Oh, too much competition there. So, yeah, okay. Now, let's talk about today's weather. And it was a grey old day for the most part. It was windy this morning, a few spots of rain, no more than half a millimetre of rain in Melbourne. Eight degrees the other day low, and late this afternoon, a top of 15. Outside, right down the playground, it is 11 degrees. The humidity at 37%, the wind and light northerly. Around Melbourne today, ooh, up at Mount Dandenong, just 10 degrees. Okay, across our state today, and it certainly has been windy. Uh, the wind pushing past 100 k's on the Grampians. And here's a first. The Greyhound meeting at Ballarat today was cancelled due to the wind. It was a howling wind, yeah, aiding today's top in the northwest. Around Australia, Hobart at Chile, 12 degrees. Those figures reversed for 21 in Sydney. Canberra, it was their coldest morning of the year so far. Canberra shipping for a minus 7 degree start for the day. Yeah. Okay, the weather charts, if there's a week of wintry cold front showers and in the northwest, dust blowing them out. The rainfall chart, up to 10 millimetres of rain the next 24 hours in Victoria's central and eastern districts. Interstate, uh, over to Perth, showers tomorrow at around 20. The big wet on Wednesday in Perth. Adelaide tomorrow, showers on 16. Hobart, 15. And if you're chilly and you're dreaming about warm weather, Darwin, 31, 32 degrees all week. Ooh. Across our state, set of showers tonight and tomorrow. Storms are possible near the coast. Uh, tonight, gale force winds, destructive gale force winds. Uh, tomorrow, temperature is pretty close to average. Okay, let's have a look at the radar, and it does show showers moving down from the northwest. Rain, in fact, only around half an hour away, so make sure you get your washing in. A go warning tonight and tomorrow for the entire coast into tomorrow, as I said, a strong wind warning for the bays and Gippsland lakes. Around Melbourne, most maximums between 14 and 16 degrees. Mount D, again, just 10 degrees. <laughs> On the bays, not always the winds of 20 to 30 knots, weighs two and a half metres. And now for Melbourne, home to great schools like St Kevin's Primary in Auburn. <laughs> Becoming wet and windy tonight and then tomorrow around 9 to 16 degrees. Still windy and wet, up to 3 millimetres of rain tonight, a third to 3 mils possible tomorrow. So on to Wednesday, 8 to 15 degrees, the rain will be gone, the cloud will stick around. On to Thursday, another grey day. Do you like grey days? No. 7 to 16 degrees, we need the rain. Friday, 10 to 15 degrees with a late shower or two. Saturday and Sunday, showery and 15 and 14 degrees. So there you have it. Tonight's weather from St Kevin's Primary in Ormond. Let's wave to everybody at home. Look forward to seeing your smiling faces tomorrow night. Cheers. They just said in my earpiece, the best school ever. I just want to say, if I can, on behalf of Channel 10, thank you very much for inviting us out. Thank you on behalf of Trum and also Blade, the live eye technician and the trucker myself. Thank you for having us out today. And let me just talk about something, if I can, very quickly, because this is a very, very good school. And because you've got good school teachers and it's a good school and your parents are very supportive, you know what that means? When you get older, you can do nearly anything you want. Yay! It is very easy, very easy to be average. Don't be average, don't be like everybody else. And don't just get a job. Move into a career so when you get up in the morning, you look forward to doing that day as a doctor, as a travel person, working in sport or whatever. There's lots and lots of opportunities out there. And because this is a good school, you can do anything you want to do as long as you don't expect somebody else to do it for you. So thank you very much. And the weather, always fine, apart from the chance for a shower. <laughs> there you go. So, everyone, I want you all to sit down. Yes, just sit down. Yes. Everyone, shh. everyone, sit down, and the teachers will take over, and the parents will take over. So, just stay where you are for a moment, okay, please? Sorry, Mike, we've got one more little announcement.